So nice to get a taste of fall this morning, and it's going to be that way most of the week as you were talking about, Chris. It really is. We're in early fall, so normally we have warm afternoons, kind of cool but not cold nights. Well, it's cold. It uh, is. By early October standards, and we'll get even colder before it warms up some toward the middle of the week. So here are your weather forecast headlines this morning. Chilly today and tomorrow. We'll have some warmer weather toward the middle of the week, maybe some rain toward the end of the week. That will depend on, interestingly enough, what a tropical storm in the Pacific Ocean ends up doing toward the end of the week. We'll have more on Lydia in just a moment. Right now, here's more on your Sunday forecast hour by hour. 49 degrees, a little chilly at 9 o'clock. When church lets out today, perhaps around noon, we'll be in the mid 60s with lower 70s headed in here for the afternoon. That's about 8 to 10 degrees cooler than it was on Saturday afternoon. A live look at I-20 I and uh, River Watch Parkway this morning. Doesn't show a whole lot going on. The cool weather is the big story this morning. 44 degrees, the temperature at Augusta Regional Airport. We do have clear skies and calm winds. Some spots are even cooler than that. We're 41 right now in Thompson, 42 in Sparta. Our coolest weather in in Edgefield, you're at 40 degrees and 43. Very cool all the way to the south in Millen. Radar network is dry all across our area, and it'll stay that way through at least Wednesday night. A very cool area of high pressure centered right over eastern Texas. Clockwise flow around that is pulling a lot of dry and cool uh, Canadian air into the area. And with clear skies and light winds tonight, it is going to get mighty chilly by tomorrow morning. To give you an idea of just how cool we are, 44 degrees in Augusta right now. That is the same temperature as it is in Bismarck, North Dakota right now. It's definitely unusually cool for this time of the year. Our next chance of rain very well could come from Tropical Storm Lydia. The winds right now are 70 miles per hour. A rare Mexican landfall is expected uh, sometime on Tuesday. What's left of that moisture will continue into the Gulf of Mexico and could mean a chance of rain for us Wednesday night through about Friday. We'll have to keep a close eye on that. Right now, your Sunday forecast looks great. Sunny skies, a crisp fall day with a high near 73. Tonight will be the coldest weather. Then we start to warm up. We'll be 38 tomorrow morning in Aiken. There is your extended forecast. A chilly start tomorrow at 38, but we'll double that for the afternoon to 76. We're back in the lower 80s by Tuesday. There's that chance of rain for the second half of the week.